In this Webflow versus Shopify comparison, I'm going to put these two popular website builders head to head and help you decide between them. I'll highlight five key reasons to use Webflow and six key reasons to use Shopify. A reminder that you'll find links in the video description to useful e-commerce resources and offers, including free trials of both platforms. Note that some of these are affiliate advertising links, meaning that we may receive a commission if you buy through them. This is at no extra cost to you, however, and using them helps us create more content. OK, let's dive in, starting with the key reasons to use Webflow. 1. You get a lot more themes with Webflow. Both Webflow and Shopify give you access to libraries of professionally designed themes that you can use as the basis for your website's design. However, Webflow gives you access to a lot more of these. Its theme library contains over 2,000 templates, while Shopify offers around 200. 2. Webflow gives you access to a much wider range of design tools. If having a lot of control over the appearance of your site or store is important to you, then Webflow can be a better choice. It gives you complete control over how your site appears on different devices, and more powerful controls for making stylistic changes to your theme. In particular, it gives you a lot more control over animations. Its template editor comes with a powerful animation designer, Webflow Interactions, that lets you create just about any type of interactive or immersive website experience you can think of. Although you can achieve similarly impressive results in Shopify, you'll usually need coding skills or developer support to get them. 3. Webflow lets you host your site anywhere you like. When you use Shopify, you have to use its built in hosting. This is very fast but ultimately you're dealing with a shared hosting service. By contrast, Webflow gives you the option to either use its own hosting service or export your site code and host it on your own server. This gives you the option to pick an ultra-fast hosting service that meets your precise requirements or reduce costs by using a budget one. 4. Webflow gives you built-in autosave and backup tools. When it comes to backing up your website, Webflow wins. It automatically backs up your site every few minutes, so you never have to worry about losing your work due to lost connections or computer crashes. Additionally, Webflow's backup system also provides a version history tool, which allows you to roll back to previous site versions with a single click. Shopify, by contrast, doesn't offer a native way to back up your store. Shopify store owners will need to back up their sites by either exporting data to a CSV file or buying a third-party app to take care of backups. 5. Webflow support materials are more engaging. The Webflow University help portal is packed full of excellent video guides to using the platform. These manage to simplify the trickier Webflow topics into very digestible content and give you the odd chuckle too. By contrast, Shopify's help pages are quite dry in nature and tend to involve text only. OK, so that's five key areas where Webflow beats Shopify. But where does Shopify win? I'll come to that in just a moment. But before I do, I'd like to invite you to subscribe to the Style Factory channel and hit the notification bell. This helps us out and gives you easy access to all our e-commerce resources and tips going forward. Right, let's take a look now at the key reasons to use Shopify over Webflow. 1. It's a much more powerful solution for e-commerce. Because it started life as a dedicated store builder rather than a web design tool, Shopify's e-commerce features are much more powerful than the Webflow equivalents. It offers more ways for accepting payments on your store, lets you sell an unlimited number of products, and is much better for dropshipping and print-on-demand. 2. It's easier to use. Because Webflow gives you control over every aspect of your store or site's design, it comes with a relatively steep learning curve. 
By contrast, Shopify has been designed for web design and e-commerce novices, and its streamlined interface reflects this. The platform is easier to use than Webflow and lets you get a site or store live a lot more quickly. 3. Shopify lets you sell at point of sale. Shopify doesn't just let you sell via a website, it gives you access to powerful point of sale software and hardware too. This means that if you sell in physical locations like retail outlets, markets, or pop up stores, Shopify is by far the better choice. 4. It's much better for selling internationally. Shopify's multilingual and multi currency features are cheaper and easier to use than the Webflow equivalents. Its excellent Shopify Markets feature lets you create different versions of your store for individual countries or currencies really easily, and it is included on nearly all Shopify plans. The equivalent Webflow feature, Webflow Localization, involves paying a monthly add-on fee of between $9 and $29, depending on how many locations you want to work with, and setting it up often requires some technical work too. 5. Shopify's App Library is considerably bigger. Shopify's App Store contains a massive collection of more than 10,000 different apps, with multiple apps available for just about any task you can think of. You can also use Shopify apps to connect the platform to a huge range of other important apps and services. By contrast, Webflow's App Store only contains around 100 apps, and this limits your ability to develop your site or integrate it with other tools. 6. Shopify offers phone support. Shopify has the edge over Webflow when it comes to customer support. Shopify users get access to live chat, email, and importantly, phone support. But Webflow only provides email support to most users. So, those are the key reasons that you might want to use Shopify over Webflow. To sum things up, Shopify is by far the better choice for e-commerce. It's a tool that is designed specifically for selling online, and its comprehensive e-commerce feature set reflects that. Webflow wins if you want to have more control over the appearance of your online store, or are particularly interested in adding animations to your site. But in most cases, if selling online is the goal, Shopify is the more professional and easier option. I hope you've enjoyed this video shootout of Webflow and Shopify, but there's lots more to learn about both platforms. Check out the video description for a link to the full blog post version of this comparison, along with free trials and special offers for the two platforms. As always, we'd love you to like this video, hit subscribe, and click the notifications bell. And finally, if you have any questions about Webflow or Shopify, do leave them in the comments. We read them all, and we'll do our best to help.